Hello everyone, welcome to In Production. So if you follow my channel, uh, you might notice that our backyard has been changing into a garden. Um, so we are planning to have some flowers and trees and some edible plants and herbs and stuff like that. So we've been cleaning uh, thoroughly here. Uh, so we cleaned out the dandelions, uh, we cleaned out those ugly tree at the, uh, at the fence. So we've been kind of spending a whole lot of days uh, just dugging out those trees with just shovels and anyways we've been cleaning out quite a bit and then now we have to find the trees and flowers to plant it right here i want to have a tree so what kind of tree i want to have um, a ginkgo tree so ginkgo trees are beneficial in many ways because they get rid of all the pesticides like bugs mosquitoes especially they hate the smell of the ginkgo tree which is kind of understandable they kind of get smelly during the summertime but I'm pretty used to it so I don't really care too much another, another thing that I want to mention is that because ginkgo trees are such an old ancient type of tree uh, they actually uh, have male and female so if you have male and female you can actually get a fruit East Asian culture uh, they use it for uh, medicine I'm not sure if it's true but if apparently if you take too much of ginkgo fruit you actually get sick because it's med supposed to be a medicine. But anyways, I'm not buying for that purpose, but that's another benefit of having a ginkgo tree. So I'm looking qu quite looking forward to it. So today I'm heading to the nursery so that I can see the tree in real life and uh, and then see the price and ask the gardener there if it's easy to you know grow, how to grow, and that kind of stuff. Anyways, here we go. It's been a while since um, I actually got to ride a car because uh, we've been staying home the whole time. And today is really summer. It's like 21 degrees Celsius. Man, it's so hot and humid. Mom, aren't, aren't you kind of, this is kind of hot. No? Why? It's okay? Um, okay. They're making a crossroad here. So now that Ontario is opening up, that there are some people outside and cars, much more cars than before, about a month ago. Mom, what do you think about like opening up this uh, Ontario right now? Do you think it's okay or? It's so too much early. It's too early? Yeah, she says it's too early. Yeah. I think Canadian medical preparation is nothing. I think. Nothing? Oh, okay. In my opinion. Right. So I think she's saying like um, Canadian medical system is not ready for opening up yet. So, all right, fair enough. Like they're they're kind of saying that um, emergency might actually extend to like at, uh, end of the June. They might actually close back up once the infection rate goes up. I don't know. They're, they're also talking about like there's going to be a second wave in September. I hope not because I really don't want to extend it up to after the summertime, which is September. I really don't want to do that. What the hell? Like, there's a lineup. Oh my god. What? That's long. Never seen before. Nursing line I've never seen before. Yeah, it looks like everyone wants to get a tree or flower. I don't know. Looks like I have to wear a mask. It's a requirement sort of these days. Can we get in? No? All right. 
All right, I'm finally in. This is so hard to buy a plant. We are looking for a ginkgo tree. What is this one? Walnut. You can buy walnut here. I don't know. What is this? Scotch pine pom pom. Are you gonna focus? Yes. Scotch pom pom pom. Alright. Alright, we finally found it. It's right here. Uh, the reason we couldn't find it is because it doesn't have any leaf yet. So. Ginkgo. This is 199. How do I know if it's a male or a female? That's the thing. I don't know if it's a male or a female. Does it have to be delivered? Okay, 199. Uh, there's different kind of ginkgo too, biloba. So there's a biloba. Okay. Welcome to the future, everyone. Everyone has to wear a mask in this area. <laughs> There's so much flowers in here too. That's nice. <laughs> I think she, she meant this one. Oh, this is the one. Spanish ivy. Spanish ivy. Oh, this is the one. Spanish ivy. That's what my mom wants. Spanish ivy. Oh, here is a little bit of a How much is this one? 28 28 This basket is 28 Wow, look at this, this one is really big Ivy, where? Ah. 18. 물어봐, 이것도. 18. 이라고. 카톡으로 해봐, 카톡. 18. 뭐냐, 18불 찾았다고. 응. 음. Now, we are also looking for a, a plant that has a pink leaf on it. Pink leaf plant. I can't find it. That's pink enough, but not quite. Hmm? Okay. 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 Get that small one. Well, then, how much is this one then? Uh, okay, I think we're done here. Uh, we've seen enough. We know the rough price of it. Uh, our neighbor is actually a gardener, so I think we're gonna ask him also see the price and then the delivery option. But because I don't think we can carry that big tree to our trunk and then go to my house. Um, yeah, I think we have to do delivery. Right. 
super hot in here. I would not want to work in here. Yeah. Uh, also, you guys do delivery for trees? Yeah. Yeah. You you have to go inside and do it. inside and do it. All right. Can we can you do the call or is it too busy right now? Uh, yeah, you just have to pay. All right. Thank you. Uh, it's gonna be twenty thirty four. Visa, please. You do have to Yep. All right. Let's go. Whew, it's hot. Ah, that was so hot in there, man. Anyways, we only bought a ivy tree, uh, which is fine. Uh, that's for my cousin's birthday. Uh, she's yeah, her birthday is was on June. I was actually hoping to get some idea of which one is male and female, but apparently I just searched the Google quickly. Uh, apparently, uh, you can't really tell unless you wait for the. Um, what's called the flower to flourish on the ginkgo tree which takes about 50 years for it to happen otherwise you have to do like a DNA t test like determine which chromosome they have which X and Y kind of thing so yeah they're not gonna tell you which sex it is unless it's like really big tree so we decided to ask our neighbor who is a gardener and he might have a better idea of how we can get like both male and fem female at like a decent price Anyways, that's been it. I'll give you an update when we actually buy some new trees. It's going to be happening soon. Should be. It was so hot. This year, summer, hopefully it's not too hot. I like hot, but you know, not too much. It's already getting too much. That's been it. I hope to see you in the next video. Uh, see you later. Bye.